Hi, it's Susan. I'm excited to be here with you at this year's House of Code and to celebrate all of your hard work. House of Code is the nation's largest STEM competition showcase. And thanks to students like you, the Congressional App Challenge is currently the largest student app development contest of its kind in the world. This past year, over 6,500 students entered the challenge and you blew us away with what you were able to accomplish. From identifying diseases in agricultural crops to teaching third graders math, your app smartly approached the challenges we face today as individuals and communities and reflect your commitment to making the world a better place. Before coming to Congress, I had a long career in technology, starting in the early days of email. I know firsthand how increasingly important coding skills and a STEM education are in our digital world. In the past 30 years, the number of jobs in STEM fields has jumped by 79%, and that number is increasing as we speak. There will be roughly 10 million STEM jobs by 2022, half of which will be in computer technology. But if we don't step up our game, we won't have enough computer science graduates to fill those positions. It's important that all students can develop the skills they need to have bright futures and to help make sure the United States remains an international leader in technology and innovation. That's why we need passionate innovators and entrepreneurs like you. Our economic future and capacity to face new challenges depends on your generation's ability to think outside the box. We need people who consistently can ask questions like, how can we use technology to solve this problem? As an example, the distancing app, the winning app for my district, was created as a direct response to the COVID-19 pandemic. Pierce, Siddharth, and Trung from Tesla STEM High School designed their app to make social distancing easier by alerting users when others get too close. By leveraging the power of technology, we can meet the moment to make our everyday lives easier and our communities safer. As you may have learned from competing in this challenge, coding is not always easy. You need determination, creativity, and hard work to ex execute projects like these. And I'm inspired by what you've accomplished already. Finally, I wanna give a special shout out to all the young women who competed this past year. As a co-chair of the Women's High Tech Coalition, a personal passion of mine is to make sure more women get involved in STEM fields where they are hugely underrepresented. In the United States, only 18% of computer science degrees are earned by women, and that needs to change. We need to create a culture that sets you up to accomplish anything you set your mind to, and we must create opportunities for everyone to fall in love with coding. To all our applicants, thank you for sharing your work and creativity with us. Whether you've been coding for years or this was your first go at creating an app, I encourage you to stick with it. Keep collaborating with your peers, keep putting your ideas out there, and keep asking yourself and others, what's next? Congratulations on this incredible accomplishment. I look forward to seeing what you can do in the future. Stay safe, stay healthy, and enjoy the showcase.